we're in the north field at Lopez Harvest on Lopez Island. And um, I first noticed wireworm problems probably about 15 years ago, 12 to 15 years ago. And I grow a lot of lettuce for the restaurants and grocery stores here on the island. And I started having, I would plant out 100 feet of lettuce and I would have maybe 40% of them would die. And that's not really acceptable when you're trying to make a living, you know? So, <laughs> so I started asking around to see if anybody else was having this problem and took some samples up to a uh, IPM specialist in uh, Bellingham and uh, she identified it as a wireworm and as a particular uh, new species of wireworm. So since then I've been mostly just mm, kind of trying to work around it. And so I'm very excited that there's research going on now to um, try to find some more uh, pinpointed techniques for taking care of it. Uh, so the project that we're out in the field here today uh, is a couple different treatments. We're looking at trap cropping with wheat and then uh, management with a spinosad bait product. Uh, so we're using transplanted lettuce as a model crop. Uh, and then we're just counting lettuce mortality uh, and from wireworm damage and then we're also doing core samples in the row where we did the treatments to get an estimate of are there wireworms being attracted to that center strip. I have other disease problems or insect problems but they're, they're sort of like one batch over here and then wireworms are their whole own category because they affect everything that um, that I do, you know, my rotations, they affect what I plant where, they affect when I plant it. Um, other things I just have to manage as they come up and where they come up. But this is something that, that really is sort of an overall problem. And, um, you know, my friends who I talk with, farmer friends, it's, it's, it's the first thing that we, that we talk about when we check in, you know. So, how are your wireworms? You know, oh, wireworms are fine, you know. <laughs> They're fine. <laughs> I am not fine with them being fine. So <laughs> So yeah, it's definitely it's definitely up there.